Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Lessons and Finger Tips. Here we discuss on some important topics with really simple words so that it is easier for you all to understand and keep things in mind. Today our topic of discussion is going to be lintel pricing. Well, we are already aware of the fact that what is public good, what is merit good, isn't it? Now, uh, we already know that uh, the government they provides what public provision to merit good. Now, how much public provision should be provided on the merit good? How is that going to be decided? What will be the, uh, you know, distribution of the social good so that it is socially optimal? But all these things are discussed in the Lindel pricing. Right. Let's begin with this topic. Lindel by means of this voluntary exchange principle based on a two-person single good model has shown that it is possible to determine uniquely how much resources should be allocated for the provision of social good and how does tax burden towards meeting the cost of good to be distributed among the person to receive benefits from the social good. Got it? So what does Lindell pricing, this Lindell uh, theorem says? It is a voluntary exchange principle. Like uh, we are taking in this model, we will be taking what? 2%. 2% one commodity this is the model okay now in this model we will see how much these two person are willing to contribute voluntary it's a voluntary contribution principle got it and here we will see that how much provision does the government should provide on the commodity how much tax the government should charge on the commodity well on what will this depend on the fact that how much the individual are willing to pay the more you are willing to pay shows that how much desire you have for that commodity. Isn't it? So based on that is the Lindell pricing. Lindell equilibrium is a theoretical state of an economy where the optimal quantity of public good is produced and cost of public good is fairly shared among all. So here if we are taking two individuals in the model, the cost of the public good that they are consuming will be divided among the two persons equally or optimally. Got it? Now let's move on to this diagram. Well, if you see very carefully that when this much, this is the demand, uh, this is the axis for individual A, this is the axis for individual B, okay. Now you see the demand for individual A is DA and DA dash and that of the, um, uh, you see the individual B is a DB and DB dash. Now you see what they are saying is that suppose the, uh, now the desired quantity is OA and D, okay, for which A is willing to pay what? D M, okay, and B is willing to pay what C N. Got it. Now, if you see here, uh, there the what they actually have to pay is H. So you can see the willingness to pay is more than they actually will have to pay. That means what? Now they can purchase more of the commodity. Abhi, I have this hundred rupees ticket, and I want to purchase a commodity. Okay, now the commodity ka price somehow have fallen to 80 rupees. So, I have 20 rupees hai na. So, that 20 rupees I can utilize for purchasing the same commodity ka thoda zyada unit. Isn't it? So, that is what here they are saying. Before going to that, let's discuss this portion. Let a community of, here we are in a community of two people. That is A and B. And the income is optimally divided between RA and RB. R A is what income of A, R B is income of B. So R kya hua is the total income. So we R ko hum how can we distribute? The total income will be distributed for purchasing the private commodities and the public commodity. Well, the private commodity X and Y, they already know ki kitna kitna lene ka hai private commodity, isn't it? Because private commodity is having a particular price, we already know how much we can afford, how much we need it. So, X and Y mein to divide hoon But what about the public commodity? That is the G. Ab isi public commodity ka price will have to be divided between the two individuals in the society. Got it? So, we R kya ho gaya? That is the total income. X and Y kya ho gaya? Private goods consumed by A and B. And G kya ho gaya? Public goods consumed in equal amount by A and B. Got it? Now, at OD, if you see, OD mein what is A's ka willingness to pay? A is willing to pay M. And what is B ka willingness to pay? B is willing to pay till M. 
सो क्या हो रहा है दिस टोटल विलिंगनेस टू पे का सम इज ग्रेटर देन 1 इजंट इट हाउ कैन आई शो यू दैट वेल हियर डी एम डी एम प्लस सी एन इज ग्रेटर देन 1 Isn't it? So, क्या हो गया? The willingness to pay for the commodity is much more than what they actually have to pay, and now the individuals can afford for more of the quantity. So, अभी government को समझ आ गया कि now I can supply more of the quantity in the market. Well, but now अभी if we are in going to this uh, OAI, there you will see A का willingness is only I L and B का willingness is J and K, J to K. So here we see that the uh, willingness to pay is falling short by K and L. That is, you can say here, say that uh, where did I write? Yes, this one. So L I plus J K is less than one. L I plus J K is less than one. A is willing to pay. I L B is willing willing to pay. J K and that is falling short. That is why it's less than one. तो अभी इसी ट्रायल एंड एरर वी विल बी डूइंग और ट्रायल एंड एरर वी विल इंक्रीज द सोशल यू नो सप्लाई ऑफ द कमोडिटी वी विल इंक्रीज द सप्लाई ऑफ द कमोडिटी एंड बाय दिस ट्रायल एंड एरर सॉल्यूशन वी विल रीच टू अ पॉइंट दैट वी विल फाइंड द सोशली ऑप्टिमल लेवल ऑफ द प्रोडक्ट दैट हैज टू बी सप्लाई यू सी इट इज एट ओ ए ई वेयर A is willing to pay E F, B is willing to pay S F, and the sum is equals to one. The sum is equals to one. When the sum is equals to one, we say thus by the process of trial and error. At O E, A is willing to pay E F, B is willing to pay S F, and O E will be the optimal amount of social good that is desired by the market. Got it? So this was all about the lintel pricing. I hope you guys have liked this video. Please do hit a like and subscribe to my channel. Guys, do comment on the comment section below. Tell me what else topic you want me to discuss. I hope that I can bring that up to you. Till then, bye bye.